G'day everybody, welcome back. My name's Andy, welcome to my channel. We're currently sitting in my workplace, in, um, in my workshop at work. And this is where I tend to get things delivered that won't fit in my post office box. I'm sitting on a crate that contains my new motorcycle lift that I purchased some time ago. And then, there's this. So I'm really excited about this one. This one's really, really, it's been sitting here for a little while now, um, for a couple of weeks, and I've been champing at the bit to try and uh, to get into it. So I haven't had a chance until now. So we're going to do an unboxing. We're going to do a reveal, and I'm going to have a chat to you about it, and maybe I can even save you some money. Here we go. I reckon this will do. Um, this workshop is the only place I can do this at the moment and I need to get this done. And uh, it, while the lighting in here is pretty good for working in all these LEDs, it's very difficult to film in. So if you get any of that, that frequency waves coming across the screen, I do apologise. Um, hey, this is my channel, that's how it works. All right, full disclosure, what's going on here? I did not pay for this. This is a, um, a promotional thing by the Foresight Company. And who are the Foresight Company? They are an Australian manufacturer of smart helmets. This is, this is why I'm really excited. They've reached out to a number of YouTubers and other social influencers uh, in the motorcycle genre trying to... Um, get some focus onto, onto their product. Now there's been smart helmets in the past that have come and gone and um, haven't been, you know, well they've been successful I guess in their own um, little ways. This one's supposed to be um, something pretty special and the fact that it's Australian and the fact that um, they've chosen me as one of their um, people that they've reached out to, I'm, I'm really quite flattered and, and very excited about this pro, uh, about the prospects of what this helmet might bring to me as a moto vlogger. Now, um, full disclosure, as I said, I didn't pay for it. They've gifted it to me. However, it is without any conditions attached. I can review this in my own way and how I see fit and, and give it the thumbs up or the thumbs down or the in-betweens whatever whatever happens there's no script there's no structure from or instructions from foresight they've they've taken a chance and said have a look tell the world what you think so let's do that Ooh. wait a minute T-shirt. I'll be right back. Hey, hey. Thank you, Foresight. All right. So what we have here is a box in a box. I'm not one who normally gets excited about unboxings, but this is nice. This is not, look, I don't know whether you can see the detail. The detail on this thing. Oh, and this is just another cover. So this helmet is their Mark 1 S. So Mark 1, well, like we're pretty early in the process here. So let's not cane them too hard. Ooh, there's a handle there. Kid at Christmas time. Like a kid at Christmas time. Beautiful. Oh, check it out. Oh. How does that open? I 
Okay. Welcome to your foresight experience. This is all really like classy looking stuff. It's not cheap junk. You are now a member of the most exclusive yet fastest growing community of motorcycle technology pioneers on the planet. Yes, get in there. And look how nice this is. This is much better than my workbench. I, I couldn't film any of this on my workbench. I've got old bloody PLC I pulled out of something and electrical offal everywhere and a single pressurised bottle filler that I'm making at the moment. It's just really busy here at work. I'm, I'm really busy. But let's, let's have a look at what we get here. Oh, well, I'm going to have to... I'm just going to have to... Um go through all of this stuff, I guess. Right, so, we get a little booklet, sticker. So this is just like a little quick change guide. A uh, quick, sorry, a little quick start guide. I'm that excited. Stickers. This, this, this little guy here is, um, a helmet, uh, sorry, yeah, a helmet controller that mounts on your handlebar. So I'm going to have to, um, I'm going to have to do that. That would be the cable for charging. Power adapter. Another cable and a USB adapter. So that's probably for hooking up to your computer, I suspect. And what do we got in here? Ooh, nice little box. Oh, that's the um, that's the mount for the handlebar. Oh, it even comes with its own. And little key. Excellent. Alrighty. Here we go. Hey. Ooh. Pin lock. Outstanding. Right, here we go. So this ca this helmet is made of carbon fibre. And um, it's pretty bloody, feels pretty nice. Oh. Now that. That looks nice. That looks really nice. D-ring for the win. Nice. Oh, sunshade. Got a breath guard. This is nice. This, this is this is really really nice. Vents on the top. At the back. Oh, look at that. That's really cool. That's really cool. I've got an adjustable spoiler on the back of my helmet. But what makes all this really cool, and this, this is really not a heavy helmet, um, is this guy. In the front of this helmet, this, there's a module in the front of this helmet that contains all the tech. So there's a camera in there, there is a built-in microphone, built-in speakers, there's... Um, these little LEDs that light up in the front here and come up underneath your, um, in your peripheral vision. So that you download the Foresight app, you connect it to, you connect your helmet to your phone, and when you're using the, the navigation system, it will indicate 
it'll, it'll tell you you've got to turn left and it'll begin to flash a yellow or amber light down in, the, in your peripheral vision on your left hand side when that turn is coming up. Same with the right, there's indicators for roadworks, for fixed radars, there's a fair bit of tech packed into this helmet. Um, I'm not fully across it all yet, so I need to do some research on that. I need to probably get the thing charged up, get the pin lock in it, and um, then go and test it. That sounds like a plan. But what I want to do... is try it on. So this helmet is a medium size. I ordered the medium size, and they reached out and said, you know, what size helmet do you wear? Um, and ordinarily, I wear a medium in most most helmets. So in the um, in the Air Eye, in the AGV, in the Shoei, in the Nolan, I, I wear a, a medium in all of those helmets. So I'm hoping that the medium in this one will fit too. There are a couple of brands that. I need to go to a large, so I'm on the top end of that medium. So let's hope that this one, this one fits okay. Um, the interior looks really nice. Looks really quite quite plush, actually. Now you can order a premium liner. I'm not sure if this is the premium liner or not. I don't know, but um, hey, I'm going to try it on. Let's let's do that. How good is that? It is a perfect fit on me. It is a perfect fit on me. So it is a little firm, but I know, you know they're all a bit firm when you first put on a new helmet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so it's got a nice gap just underneath the, on that first click. Um, doesn't feel crowded. No, it feels nice. Feels good. How's the liner? And, and like I said, a D, D ring for the win. Wow. Wow. Hey. Wow, wow, wow. Yes. Yes. So excited. Um, this is going to be a game changer for me as a vlogger. I don't have to have a GoPro mount on the front of it. I can have the, um, I can still listen to music on my radio, take phone calls, all of that sort of thing. I get the added advantage of the a uh, heads up kind of display it's not a actual heads up display but you know little indicator uh, warnings and what have you not when it's working in conjunction with the app so like i said next video is going to be me testing this helmet testing this camera testing all the all the all the stuff inside the the headset and um and going into a bit more detail about the helmet because i will have done a bit more reading about it Hang on, let me get this thing off. Whew. Right. Okay, so if this is something that floats your boat, if this is something that might get you excited, uh, if you're in the market for a new helmet, and, and you've got to remember, like, this has got all the media stuff in there. So you put the price of a helmet up, a good quality helmet, and then put the price of a GoPro and all the mounts and the internal speed, speed microphone, everything else that you've got to put together with it, this represents honest value. It's track legal. You can have a camera in it and go to the racetrack. And at the moment, Foresight have got a spring bundle. We're going to lose that camera. We just lost that camera. That's fine. At the moment, Foresight have got a spring bundle. And that gives you a 238 Australian dollar discount when you bundle up a couple of different things with the helmet. So extra visor, pin lock, premium padding, order that with your helmet and they'll take $238 off. And you can get a further 5% discount if you use the code Andy's, but instead of an S, use a 5. So Andy 5. 5 of me. So I'm going to do my... I'm going to do my Luddite best to put all those links in the description. So the link to the Foresight um, website where you can, you can purchase one if you want and obviously add the code Andy's. So the Andy's code gives you 5% off, including the bundle, like another 5% off. Um, and the good part about that is a little bit of that money goes to me and I get to, I get to have a bit of a win out of it.
But, but like I said, I'm under no obligation to Foresight. They don't own me. They're not paying me for this shit. They are, I do get a bit the benefit of some... Um, um, like if there's a sale, I get the benefit of doing it. For, for, for taking my time to come and do this uh, for you good people. But I'm really excited about this helmet. I'm, really, I'm genuinely excited about it. No more camera hanging off the front. Um, it's all nice and compact. And the fact is that that's the most expensive part of this hat, except, I mean, it's still a quality shell. But if you were to damage this, they can, if you get, get it back to foresight, they can remove all of that media componentry and insert it into a new shell and put it all back together for you as a new helmet, you know, as part of your insurance claim, whatever, to keep your costs down. So this is an innovative company. They're going, they're going to go places, I think, um, just by the look of the quality and um, the, the fit and finish of this helmet. I think it's going to be, um, it's right up there with anything else. So looking forward to trying it out. Looking forward to doing some uh, onboard show, footage with it and testing it a bit more. Make sure you come back and try and, and have a look at that when I get that video done. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and all that sort of crap. Share it. Share this. Share it. This is exciting. Um, and I'll catch you next time on Andy's Motorcycle Obsessions. Bye for now.